Hello, welcome to the video. So this is the start of the Maestro quest line. You need to get this item, Bag of Nuts, which you get from Goldrick. And to be able to talk with Goldrick, you have to do the quest lines, which pretty much means you just talk with Cowboy Jones here and do what he says. I think you start with doing some quests for him. Then you gotta talk with Bandit Bob, do some quests for him. And then you start talking with Goldrick, this guy here. And then you do some quests for him. And then you finally get the item needed to start the Maestro quest. And let's go. We drop it here. Mmm, peanut. Yum, 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 yum. The blob of light snatches the bag of peanuts, takes a look at the bottom left of your screen, then quickly go. Wait, no. He is fellow beginner. Hi, 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 hi. Please come talk with me. Oh, you actually vanished. A good thing I managed to read it. Peanuts, entire bag too. Yay! Very cool to see a club member. Many rage quit before finding me. I am Maestro Member Cactolite. I am next step to you becoming the bestest beginner to ever begin. Ever. As long as lava doesn't interrupt me, I can give you quest to become a maestro class yourself. Alright, nice. Lava's not around. Let's do this. I am under strict orders from club leader. He tell me to only rank up people who are top skill edge. Rock busting, hammer hitting, and the three thingy. They are some skills you need. Get the required skilling, mining, spinning, shopping. I have done that before. Here we have it, super skill edge. You need mining, 32, smithing, 45, and shopping, 33. And I have already prepared that. Sweet skill edge, but that's no top skill edge. You are not ready just yet. Ocean Murder, Water Stirring, and the Buggy One. They are the other skills you need. The Buggy One? Ocean Murder is Fishing, Water Stirring is Alchemy. Ah, the Buggy One, Catching. Yeah, pretty good joke. 23 in Fishing, you need 25 in Alchemy, and you need 25 in Catching. Whoa, 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 okay, wow. That's some super skillage, but I am very sad. Too sad to give you new class membership. Unless, could you help me? I have a peanut. It is very old. It was my first peanut. It is my best friend. It will decay to dust soon. Please make it better. Defeat big hours with this peanut in your inventory. Don't drop it or it will decay to dust in five seconds flat. Elderly peanut. It has a very peculiar stench. The smell is so unbearable. Your damage is lowered by 50% and your max HP is only one. Only the sands of a dead big hours minibus could reverse the aging this peanut has undergone. Right. First thing first, I'm gonna get a new hat to celebrate this occasion. I'm gonna craft the acorn topper. And there we go. This one has 23, this one has 30. Here we go. 42 defense versus 23. I guess we can craft some elephant armor to him as well. 50 versus 28. Now you have to defeat the mini boss with 1 HP, which means you can't get hit. So you have two options. You can either run around with a bow, really tedious, and then try to dodge him constantly. Or you can simply get your defense up high enough, which is what I will try to do. 12% more defense. We have 418 right now. Here is another one to give defense. Now we have 449 to craft another item here. 48, 32. I guess I can craft this one here. Golden plop and some fish. And there we go. A defender dignity. 521. You need 594 defense. You know what I realize? I'm just going to have to upgrade this and we should be fine. I might have to do a reset afterward. But oh well. 605 defense. Yep. Just upgrade the buckle up for the first time in the game. This one is useful. We need one more item. Two wood circular, one. Capitalist case, right. Let's buy one of those. One googly eye, thank you for that. And let's go. I don't really like this helmet. It looks like it got a beard and one of those top knot man buns, rather. I'm some kind of hipster right now. Beard and man bun. Ah, oh, come on. I put the googly eyes back. Right, so to do zero damage against Big hours, you need 594 defense. We have 605. If you don't do this trick here, you have to use a bow. And every time he comes close, you have to 
slide down the rope. It's going to take you a very long time. I highly recommend you do it this way instead. Now you can pretty much only go AFK. And here we go. Drop them. Hello, big hours. I'm going to start beating you up. Let me see what the quest says before I collect. Oh my god, no! Oh yeah, there he is, yeah. Oof. That scared me. And yeah, this is pretty much how easy it is when you have the defense needed. Like I said, just give him your best gear. You don't have to craft it from scratch. You can just take it from someone else. Put in the defense card. Forest soul and the sheep as defense. If you still can't make it, you simply pump this here up. Bucklered up. At 71, it gives me 20% more defense. I would say that's pretty good. And like I said, if you don't have the defense, you have to use a bow. And whenever he's approaching you, you have to slide down the rope. These can't hurt you anymore. And then you gotta get up again. Not sure why he stopped moving. Here we go, he's moving again. And there we go, almost done. One more hit. Two more hit. And there we go. And let's see here. There we go. He's now a happy one. Pete the Peanut. Now that's a happy looking peanut. I wish he was my best friend, but no one wants to be friend with sentient item dialogue. Hmm. Poor little item dialogue. We have collected Peter Peanut. Let's go back. Pete, yay! Oh my god, Pete, you look good. Good enough to eat. No. Wow. All that, and you just ate him. Hmm. No, Pete, no, I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. Well, too late. I'm gonna become a maestro. Hooray, skill master. Oh well, at least Pete was tasty. Oh hey, you're a maestro now, cool. And that's it. We got some balloons and we have this here. Weapon power, luck, defense. Wow, defense 20. 35% skill XP. This is massive bonus. Get out of here. Let's compare. 5 luck, 5 defense, 3 XP monster. 20 luck, 20 defense, 35 skill XP. Yeah, I will keep that one. Uh, not sure what to do with this one anymore. Maybe you can actually keep it. And this is the quest we missed. Maestro the straw man. Become a maestro. Let's see here, what can we do? Coin toss. Throw a coin that deals 100% damage. Damage also increases the more money you have. Not bad at all. Let's give some points into that. A bunch of damage for every lowest skill level I have. Hmm. I guess this guy has to do some worship. Print one hour of that instantly. That's pretty good. Let's put one point into this one. What the hell? Not sure what this one do. Well, this one is pretty good. More class XP, the more luck you have. And Obel give more luck. Don't really need that one. XP power feast to give more bonus. No thanks. Max level to happy dude and lucky horseshoe. I don't think I have anything in either. XP game for all skill. Hmm. This one will be really good when you start skilling, especially for the happy dude. Sleeping on the job talent. Which one is that? This one here, AFK gain rate. You get more XP, but you are worse at it. Hmm. Killing a crystal or giant lowers the requirement XP of a random skill by 2%. Hmm. I'm not going to do much active playing, so... Oh, this one is really good. Skill XP for your other characters if their skill level is lower than Maestro. Skill efficiency. This one is probably better, actually. And well, let's bump up the damage. It's our only damage attack. Let's bump this one as, up as well. Family bonus, print the sample size. Okay, that's really good. Let's try out our new coin. Ooh, new skill. Come on, use the coin. It doesn't auto. What the hell is it doing anyway? I need to look it up again. Oh, there's a coin. Throws a coin which deals 200 damage. Damage also increases the more money you have. I have one of these. It doesn't do anything. I can click here and fire it, I guess. That one was a bit disappointing. I wanted another auto attack. Instead, I got a weird attack that does not... Oh. Oh, it's one of these. Oh, no. Like the shaman ability. Yeah, I did not want one of those. That's why I hate the shaman. Because it doesn't do anything unless you are doing the aiming. Whoop. Boing, boing. I mean, damage is good and all. I'm not gonna complain about that. Now the question is, should I keep this ring on him? 
Like if he's going to be skilling, he doesn't need his defense. Speaking of defense, let's remove all this crappy card. Probably something like that. And yeah, that's how you get the Munch Brew. Really simple once you pass the, you know, Wall of Fire that is the catching game. There is a hooping quest. You have to get 15 in a row or a total of 90. So I'm gonna call it here. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.